Hmm. I'm coming to you from a place like approximately 25 miles north of San Jose, California. This actually used to be my old neighborhood. <laughs> well, not this per se. This is the reservoir. And then those trees, beyond those trees, that's Half Moon Bay, California. And pretty much every day, about 3, 3.30, the fog would roll over the hills. Well, today, uh, this is actually Belmont, California. This is where I used to live uh, approximately like 28 years or so ago with my family. I have some good, happy, fond memories, and I also have some bittersweet memories of living in this place. And I don't know if any of you have like some what ifs in your life, you know, like for me, it was like we moved up here when I was nine years old and then we moved back down to Southern California when I was 15, right in the middle of high school, literally. So freshman, sophomore year, I was up here, went to high school, gaining some friends and all that. And then junior, senior, senior year, I went to high school in Southern California. <laughs> so I have a lot of what ifs in my life. <laughs> But not as much anymore, but, you know, it's just kind of eerie and odd to come back to a place where you used to live ah, and find a yellow jacket on your hand. <laughs> um, back in the day, prior to us moving away, uh, my mother was actually the very first uh, female mayor of this town. First, she ran for city council. She didn't win, didn't get on. And then a few years, like the next election, she tried again, and she was successful, and she won the city council election, got on the city council, and while she was on the council, they tend to rotate the mayorship, and so it was her turn, she was the mayor, first female mayor of Belmont. True story. I bet you didn't know that. <sighs> so yes, I do have a famous relative. <laughs> Maybe not in the celebrity scene, but perhaps in the political world out there. But every day, seriously, my, my, I just loved it. It was like my serenity. I would just walk the dog every single afternoon and just enjoy this view. I mean, it just doesn't get better than this. Happy Columbus Day, all. Oh, and by the way, it's usually, it's usually never 80 degrees like it is today, right now. So I thought I'd take advantage of it. Tomorrow it's supposed to rain, so I had to get outdoors. Mm-hmm. <laughs>